serpent-shaped ring. Every single day, I wear a ring around my finger, serpent-shaped and fueled with sin, because I know if Eve had been me, I without a doubt would have tasted the forbidden fruit just as she did. Because I long for wisdom, I long for disobedience, I long for a paradise without a king, without constraints. I myself long to be creator of paradise. And I am aware apples aren't always sweet, but just for the possibility of a slice of sweetness, I will give in to temptation, I will taste the sourness for the possibility of true and independent power. I will drag all of humanity into the depths of hell with me. The serpents with the fire within. I think I look hot with a cigarette resting between my cherry red lips, polluting my lungs and my soul. Perhaps that is my toxic trait, but well, I am filled with poison anyway, as I am a woman, and it is our power to destruct a fragile righteous man with a black tar running through our veins. We are poison ivy, the origin of sin. The serpents with a fire within. Our hearts tainted by apples and Lucifer's pride. The witches that drag or the innocent man. From paradise to hell and enchant them with black magic spells. But well... Perhaps the pearls and perfume I wear around my soul can cover up my evil nature and lie a shield of purity around my rotten body. Perhaps I can even steal an angel's pretty wings and finally die in innocence. Honey and acid. Life is dipped in honey and corrosive acid, sugar coating your body and burning you inside. Did the dinosaurs feel the decay of this world? I wonder. The artificial rot disguised as progress and the destruction and construction of endless consumption. But now, let me drown inside consumption, inside hedonism, inside Dionysus' arms, as I am human, as I am mortal, I cannot know another way to live. Come, let me swallow honey and ambrosia and let me suffocate inside my greed. Come, let me burn inside my own destruction.